Hi everybody, followers, open foamers, welcome to the new screencast series number seven. Still not there, but after I publish this video, I will make it, uh, I will make the new guy here. So how you can reach this um, screencast series, it's uh, on my webpage, Holtzmann CFD. Then you go to teaching and in the teaching you have this list. What is it about? The new screencast series will be called Christmas competition, or I will just name it Susan. Uh, it is very similar to number four, creating a project, but I will take this opportunity uh, um, to make a new screencast based on the idea Joseph had. And Joseph made or invented a community Christmas competition here. So you can go to his channel and check the introduction video. Uh, what it is about and um, to make it short and to let you know what is it about in my screencast. Um, actually, it's very simple. The competition is about calculating the drag coefficient of Susan's head. So this monkey is called Susan. And we have two constraints for our simulation. The first one is that we have to use Susan's head. And the second one is that the flow direction is uh, direct going into her face. Um, everything else is up to us. So that means Joseph gave us the freedom to choose Lamina, Runs, or LES. Maybe people have too much computational uh, power that they will make a DNS simulation. I have no idea. Uh, to calculate the drag coefficient. Yeah. And the idea behind is that it is collected. So Joseph collects everything. There is a deadline, 21st of November. And you can go through his um, screencast here to his introduction to check out what you need to participate. In order that no one is stealing my ideas, I will publish the screencast series after 21st of November. And I hope you're looking forward to that. Just a few interesting things which might be in interesting for you. I will work a bit more with Blender here to generate this uh, geometry, to make the STL file, to make the background mesh, or at least the, the, the corners for my background mesh. I will calculate the projected area of the monkey head of Susan's head, which is very easy to do. We will close the eyes because if you go through this video and if you make this monkey head, you will see that these eyes are not connected to the head. So there are some things, some small things we have to consider here. Then we will mesh it um, and set up the simulation how I did this. Of course, there are a lot of other options. And actually, after we have the step file and the background mesh, it follows more or less um, screencast number four. However, um, during the numerical analysis or during the setup of OpenFORM, I think it, it's just one, one screencast very fast done in, in five, 10 minutes. But actually, I always need longer. <laughs> and if there is time, I, because I promised it already that I will make screencasts about Blender rendering. And if this is possible, if I have the time, I will also post-process this data, maybe not all, but one or two, and show you how you can use Blender for post-processing open foam data in a very nice way. And that's all. So I hope that you are looking forward to, to the screencast and share it if you like it or give me feedback. Feedback is always recommended and yeah, so I can improve my whatever English skills or turning off my washing machine, uh, which is actually not running right now. So yeah, that's all for now.
I'm looking forward to your contribution. I hope there are a lot of contributions and a lot of nice different cases. And yeah, we will see who will win. And finally, I want to say that if you are winning, you get a, f a fucking nice t-shirt, which is so, so easy that it is so good. But I, I, I cannot find it right now. So just go through the um, Joseph's video and, and you will you will see. Okay, guys, bye bye and I'll see you soon. Hopefully, uh, for people who are in Austria, see you uh, in the next fall, which takes place in Leoben.